Good morning, church. Um, I've loved this series so far. I've loved hearing from everyone um, and all the different people. And um, today I've got 1 Corinthians 12, verse 25. Um, and it says that there may be no division in the body, but that the members may have the same care for one another. And the whole verse in Corinthians talks about that we are part of the body. God chose us to be part of the body. Um, he chose our part to play and um, that we need to act like a body and care for each other. So the message talks about flourishing and um, people in pain. And I think this season really seen that was in that people, some people have flourished in lockdown and absolutely loved it and found new talents and things that they love and it's been really great for them. And then others have found it really hard or if you're a bit like me, going up and down into different seasons of both of those things. Um, but it's just so important that we are there with each other, um, whatever people, wherever people are at. So if people are hurting, that we really feel that pain with each other, with them. And if they're flourishing, that we rejoice in that. And we're, we're so pleased for them because we're not competing. We're not against each other. We're part of one body, functioning as one body. Um, so yeah, I just love all the examples of that in the season. I love that people have shown care in small ways that have gone so far. Um, in the summer, there was, I think, five or six weddings. Um, and it was so good to see that the church rejoiced with people, even though that they couldn't all be there um, in person. They rejoiced with the people that were getting married. And we really felt that. And yeah, it's just so good to know you've got the body behind you. Um, yeah, and I just encourage you to get creative, um, show care in ways that you can and be creative with it. I've been really blessed by people just showing care in simple ways. Um, and in John, it says that we will be known by our love for each other. And I think it really does speak that when we show care for each other, when we show that we love each other, when we're there for, in each other's pain, um, it really speaks to the world. Um, and we can do all of this because Jesus first cared and loved for us in such a good way. <laughs>